Today's collectible spot, we're having a look at the quality brand Bitta Krita vinyl figure. Indicated at the top left corner, it's guaranteed fresh. This comes to us from, I flip it over, from the good folks over at 3D Retro and Scott Tolson. Designed by Scott Tolson, sculpted by Tim Wallweber. 2013 collector's item only. This is not a toy. It is not designed or made for children. Um, I like the box. Um, obviously, the front, you can see inside the bit of Krita. A nice open window. So even if you wanted to keep it in box, you can certainly do so and still appreciate the design quality on the figure itself. On the side, we got some what looks to be Argyle print. It says BC on the top on the side there on a, on a ribbon. It carries over to the top there, quality brand Bit of Critter. And around on the back, an image of Bit of Critter. It says, still drink from a bottle. I do it because I'm bitter. Don't think I have problems? Meet my babysitter. That's really neat. I like that quite a bit. I also really like the packaging color. The overall choice of the color really makes it look like a craft item. I really like that. I also really like Argyle. I, I'm just a sucker for Argyle. What I am going to do is I'm going to take a break. I'm going to get this opened up, and when we come back, we're going to get a better look at the quality brand, Bitta Krita. There's definitely more to come. Don't go anywhere. Stay tuned. Before having a look at the bit of Krita, the one accessory that does come with it is a little bottle. A little bottle with a nice label around the bottom of the bottle itself. Nice brown label, a nice, nice brown bottle there. Put that aside. And let's have a look at the bit of Krita. I gotta say, a lot of times with vinyl figures, the one thing that you really get from them is the is a good paint, a good solid paint job on these. The bit of Krita um, really is nicely painted. I mean, on the underside, you got bit of Krita. It's got Tolson at 3D and 3DRetro.com. The coloring is really really nice, though. It it almost has a vintage look to it, which I like quite a bit as well. There's the face. Has a real personality to it. One eyebrow is up. Got some freckles going on there as well. But then when you get to the actual costume um, that the Bitter Credit is wearing, I like the little stitching, the little patchwork uh, present. I also really like this the additional wash that they've put in the in the top piece as well as the actual body of the, the suit as well. A little patch on the on the elbow. Stitching in the front there. Let's not, of course, forget. Um, I'm always a sucker when it comes to patched eyes, like little doll patched eyes, and it's a bit of credit has that as well. It's a it's a pretty large piece by comparison to some of the other vinyl figures that Spot has reviewed. The bit of credit is a little bit larger than some of the um, the standard vinyl figures, which probably are about the yay big or so. Um, there is articulation. The bit of Krita's head does rotate left and right. Arms rotate back and forth as well. Uh, no articulation in the legs. No articulation in the extra tail piece there, which is some nice detailing in the paint is in the tail as well. Uh, it, it feels like it's a solid piece too, which I really really like. Um, I, I think they did an, an excellent job on the figure itself. It's it's got a lot of personality. Sometimes with vinyl figures, personality doesn't always get carried through and doesn't always become the forefront of the vinyl figure itself. With a bit of credit, there's definitely a lot of personality, and I like that quite a bit. Uh, if you are interested in picking up a bit of credit yourself, a lot of comic book stores, you can usually order them through. If they're not available, a lot of comic book stores will order them for you. Um, and also, again, I'm going to provide the links down below from 3D Retro if you want to check out their store. Probably you can pick them up through there as well. A really fun vinyl figure, though. Today's collectible spot, we're having a look at the Bitta Critter vinyl figure. Thanks for watching, guys. Certainly stick around. Spot's got more collectible spots heading your way. I'll see you guys next time.